There are five ways I know to combat high ammonia and nitrite readings. You can use them all at once, or you can use them one at a time. You can remove the ammonia and nitrite by using a prime water conditioner to make the water safe for your koi, but keep the feeding constant so the bacteria has a constant supply of food to feed on. You can increase the bacteria of the ammonia and nitrite by using gels, balls, etc. I keep a stock of Micro Lift Night Out 2 and Columbo Bacto balls for this purpose. You can dilute the ammonia and nitrite. You can increase the trickle in or water changes through a three pod purifier to dilute the nitrite. Personally, a trickle in keeps the pond more stable and it's better than a huge water change which the koi notice and relax to. You can relieve the ammonia and nitrite symptoms by adding salt at half an ounce per gallon. Please use a salt meter. If you have a shower, you can increase the turnover or flow over it so more ammonia is gassed off. This also reduces the amount of nitrite and nitrate in the pond. Personally, I think a high turnover on a shower helps the bacteria colonize the shower quicker as it spreads the bacteria quicker by the faster flow. There is a lot of air in the water as it splashes down and the media is covered with a thin film of water. So the other side of the water is open to the air. So there is a lot of air water contact or exchange. As the turnover is higher, the bacteria get to feed off the ammonia and nitrite in the water. It's more efficient. If the bacteria misses some of the ammonia or nitrite in the water, it comes around again quicker. So the bacteria get a second bite of the cherry. <laughs>